Hi, I'm Kenzie from One Kids Life and Classy Mommy, and I am so excited to be working with Crayola today to show you guys this awesome play sand. It's colorful, it's clean, it's easy, and it doesn't stain. And this sand, you can buy it at Walmart for under $7. It is a 20 pound bag. You can see how much sand we poured out, and it's still really, it's really heavy. heavy. You can get this at the garden center mm -hmm. at Walmart, so easy to under pick up. Under $7 for 20 pounds of sand. It's a perfect fun thing you can do for any craft idea in the summer. If you have little kids with a sand table, add water, yeah, make sand, sand castles. Water fun, and there's four colors, right? Up. Yes, pink, purple, green, and of course, blue. So, Which is really fun for the 4th of July. Yep, so we um, need some fun 4th of July crafts. 4th of July is coming up. So your tweens, and twe your tweens and teens <laughs> might like making the crafts. The little mm -hmm. preschoolers would like some of these fun yes. crafts that we came <laughs> up with too. Um, and of course the sand and water table is great. But look at these cool 4th of July themed ideas that we yeah, that so Kenzie came up with. Like anyone, any ages can play with this. We literally just took a cute little bin. You can buy this anywhere at Walmart. And we just poured some of the great sand in. You can rake it along, pick it up. I love and the tactile things also, for preschoolers too. Yeah. They love touching, feeling with their hands, Another raking. thing that's really cool, we bought these cute little fake succulents in 4th of July colors. And you can stamp the sand into little stars. Oh, that's really which cute. Which is so cute. And it's like a little zen garden, how yeah, you have this set up zen with garden. plants. You can rake it out. It's Feel really it, fun. Feel it, decorate And I love the little mm -hmm. stamping idea. That's really cute yep. too. And then also a nice little just decoration for any 4th of July party. Fill a mason jar with sand, super easy, halfway up. We added some cute 4th of July American flags and we tied a little ribbon around it for and that's really the cute. red, white, and blue. And I'm going to use this when we have a barbecue for the July to decorate when I have the food yeah, set perfect up. So table to perfect table topper to keep the napkins down with the wind. Okay, so what else did you make here with so, another mason jar? What's another this mason jar. You can do anything with mason jars. This is just some sand at the bottom. And then we had this huge bag of like random craft supplies just at our house. But you can buy them anywhere again. I put some little red streamers in here okay. and some cute little white oh, cotton balls. Oh, red, white, and blue layer. Red, white, and blue. Oh, this is great. So I could even use this as a flag, right, Kenzie? Yeah. Like when I'm decorating for my tables. Okay, anything. that's cool. And then and what's then this lastly, final one? This is toddlers really cute. would like this too. So all I did, it's super simple. I just put glue, any kind of glue on the paper. I traced out the letters and the shapes I wanted to do. Put it over my little thing so the sand didn't get messy. And I poured sand all over it. And then when shook you it shook off. it off, it came out so this perfect. This would be fun too like if you're this. babysitting little kids or if you've yeah, younger brothers fun, and sisters. Yeah, fun like craft ideas. You could put, write their name. You could do anything, and you uh, can have them, the older like, child can do it, it, and then the kids can pour the sand. Yep. And presto, it's like magic. Awesome. Yes. So, so this, this is, is great. so cool. You can get this 20 pound bag of sand from Crayola at Walmart for under seven dollars. So what a great, it is fun so summer fun. idea. I love summer this. Craft. And uh, it's so great. Awesome. So happy Fourth of July, everyone. Yep. Bye.